Troubleshooting send and receive errors in 2010 and 2013 Outlook. Disable work offline. Work offline is located at the top right, as highlighted. Method two, reconfirm email account settings. Click on file at the top left, which will bring you to account information. Click on the button that says account settings and then click on account settings under it. Once at the account settings page, click on the account that you would like to check the settings for. Once at the change account page, make sure that your name is correct, the email address is complete, the incoming mail server and the outgoing mail server are also correct. Below you'll see the username. Now, Sometimes usernames actually do require full email addresses, so make sure that's correct as well. Then make sure the password is correct. Once finished, click on more settings at the bottom right. Go to the outgoing server tab and click on my outgoing server requires authentication checkbox. Click on the advanced tab. Make sure all of the server settings are also correct, such as the port numbers and the type of encryption or authentication required by the server. Once finished, click OK. And then click on Next to test the server settings. Click on Finish. Method 3. Disable all add-ins. Click on File at the top left. When the File menu opens, Open Options. Click on Add-ins. Click on Go at the bottom. Make sure to uncheck all add-ons and then click OK. Method 4. DNS Flush and WinSock Reset. Opening Command Prompt in Windows XP. Click on the Windows key and tap on R. This should open up the run box. Type in C for cat, M for Mary, D for dog. Click on OK. Launching command prompt with elevated privileges in Windows Vista and Windows 7. Click on the start menu button and then type in CMD. Command prompt will pop up at the top, right click it, and then left click run as administrator. Once the command prompt is open, type in ipconfig forward slash flush DNS and then push enter. Then type in net sh and then push enter. And then type in winsock space reset and click enter.